What's going on, everybody? Let me turn the light on. Get a little light in here. Today we have. Oh, one second. There we go. Today we have mail call and a package from Chubby Pop Chaser. Whatnot package. For his first whatnot auction, I went ahead and went on there and tried to help him out, give him a few bids here and there, and won a few items. Should be three books in there, but let's go with the uh, fun stuff for his mail call from eBay. And from Nostalgia Source, it's going to be newer books. Nothing old. I haven't bought a lot of old books lately, so let us see what we got. <sighs> My new schedule, well, I've been trying to tell you guys, but I don't know when this video is going to get put out, is Monday is going to be Wednesdays and Fridays. And we should have Whatnot every Sunday and Cranky Comic Chat on <sighs> Sunday nights. New job. We're doing 10 hours a day, 4 days a week. I'm still in training. So, who knows? Let's, we'll see how it goes. My feet are killing me pretty bad. So. But then again, I haven't done this kind of work in years. So, let's see what we got. You will notice repetition in the first two bags. I think they're stuff I bought doubles of just to have. So, give me a moment. I'll get the tape off of these. <coughs> This came with bags and backing boards because I have almost none. I've got like bad condition ones that I'm refurbing to use and things like that. So just have not. There's none available right now. I was able to get some off of eBay. I think for like twenty-three dollars shipped. Maybe it's a little bit more than that, but not bad. So I got a hundred coming. That'll save. That'll put me over for a while. But okay, hopefully let's see what we got. Nothing expensive in these lots, I think. Person who wraps them didn't even. They're using old bags too. I mean, look at these things. So let's go and we'll see. You'll see. You'll know right offhand what this is kind of gross. Oh, well, first one Stray Dogs number. Stray Dogs number five. <laughs> I wonder what this is. Stray Dogs number four. These are the latest prints. They're fourth and fifth prints. I just never got the series. Stray Dogs number three. These backing boards are like trashed. Kind of pisses me off. But oh well. Stray Dogs number two. <laughs> Silence of the Lambs cover maybe. Is that what that is? I'm not sure what cover that is. Oh well. No big deal. And of course, Stray Dogs number one. This one does, this set did not come with the, uh, with the, uh, what do you call it? With the, uh, sorry, brain just took a left hand. With the uh, blank cover, which I need to get a copy of, so. Okay, this is from Ziggy at Nostalgic Source. Uh, it should be fairly, yeah, a repetitive here. You can see real quick. He had some of the older, some of the older uh, versions, and then when the new ones came out, I said, "Give me one of each." Ooh, I just cut into myself pretty good. Oh, that oh paper cut. Ow, that hurts. Paper cut's not fun. Not from the knife. The knife did not cut me. It was the edge of these cardboard that got me. So hang on a moment. I'm going to at least put some pressure on as I stop. You saw it here. They all went flying. No big deal. These are just reader copies for me, I think. I don't think the fourth and fifth printings are going to be worth a ton of money. So mainly reader copies. I wanted to read the series and, and I've not been able to pick up anything major. Let me get a quick piece of... Just something to hold down this bleeding for a moment. Yeah, it's going to hurt for a day or two. That's fine. I wipe off the blood. It's pretty much stopped. As usual, I tap the uh, I tap the thing in my camera so I'm about to splice these together. No big deal. I'll do that right after I'm out of here. So this one, Ziggy puts everything in a Gemini and then puts it in a Nostalgia Source. Guys, if you need new books, he gets pretty good stuff. Order with them on, you know, Tuesday or Wednesday. You usually get everything you can. It's a little more books than I thought I had. But they're mainly, you guessed it, the same ones I already got. So they're going to be doubles of, should be Stray Dogs, one through five, plus the white one. Dang. This is like, 
Oh well, I'll put a band-aid on it later. I'm pretty much working in construction sites now, so I'll just put a band-aid on it later. No big deal. He packs them inside of... Sorry if it's a slow night and my body is just, I'm tired. I'm going to bed early. Videos, I don't think we'll have any problems in any excuse of video. We are approaching 350 people. I think we're almost at 340. So, I'm going to work on some kind of giveaway. i got to see if anybody else who could really would help me out. Will help me out. If not, I'll just come up with a box to give out. Okay, we'll just go through these. See what we got. First up. Ah, Stray Dogs number two. This is a second print of number two. So, not the fourth or fifth print around now. And we have a second print of number three. And, of course, the rest of these we will probably know. Stray Dogs number one. This is the one I was hoping for. The blank copy. I'm thinking about doing the CGC thing. We will debate on that. It's $200, but they will do a drawing of your dog. Which, I'm a dog guy. What do you want? Okay, Stray Dogs number two. It's like fifth, sixth printing or whatever it is. Uh, hang on. We have Nostalgia Source's little uh, thing. Look for them on Instagram. Stray Dogs number three. Guess what? Stray Dogs number four. <laughs> and he has nice bags. Unlike yeah, the other ones I'm going to work on. And Stray Dogs number five. So that is it for this. On this one. Finally, we have... Jerry, Chubby Pop Chaser. We have a box from him. There should be three books in here. Let's see if I can not cut myself open. There was an old Spider-Man in here too, I got I think. I just saw ones I was like, yeah, I'll put bids on them. If I get them, I get them. Not a big deal. Okay. The packaging, of course, Gemini Mailer. It was kind of weird. That my, I don't think there's anything wrong with this. Today. He said there was three books, but... When he did his shipping, he only showed two books, which is fine. None of these books costed more than a few dollars each. So, to me, they were just kind of for fun. And to get people on this channel and help him out. Very good packing. We have the Chubby Pop Chaser sticker. I don't know why I sounded a weird voice there. <clears throat> I do guys look forward and check in on Sundays on whatnot. I do small auctions, just 25 to 30 books. Especially with the job and everything coming up, I've been busy. I'm barely going to go through books to start getting ready. Because it's not, it, it does take a little time to do it. But I like doing it, so. And also, it helps me afford these for the things I do want. Uh, I'm waiting for, going to get some more. There should be some. The only mystery boxes right now I've got coming, if anything, are going to be. You guys love them, that Spider Man booth. <laughs> And uh, I'm back on the Box Heroes bandwagon, so that's I, I really did like my last box, so I signed up for the monthly on that. Back on the monthly, I used to be on it all the time. But I'm also going to try some local guys, Nostalgia Source, or Nostalgia, I forgot his name. And Instagram has one right now, I'm just waiting for Whatnot to pay me. <laughs> Whatnot does take a while to pay. Jerry, we're on a little... Jerry wrote a nice little note to us. Very nice. He didn't go with the... What do you call it? But anyway, very cool. Let's see what we got. Now, I have reasons behind two of these books. The other one was just an extra pickup. First one, Micronauts. Oh, King Size Annual number two. <clears throat> so, I like the Micronauts. I always have. These are just the fun buys. Fantastic Four number 17 annual. And finally... Ah, oh, gotta love it. Decent shape. I mean, it's got some bends in it, but who cares? The Amazing Spider-Man number 87. Presents well. Has a minor chip or two, but hey. For the price, you know, with whatnot, you do sometimes. Books go for way cheaper than you want them to, so. Either way, nice book that I'll either put in my collection or it will go into a mystery box or somewhere else. He didn't use the uh, whatnot thing when it came to... Uh, no big deal. I've already verified it, so you should have the money from it. That's it, guys. Nothing exciting or new. I'm still planning on doing the video on EPACs. I just have had zero time to even think about it. And the job's been a big deal. So, thanks for watching, guys. I will talk to you soon.